Hello guys, welcome back. It's No Serial here, and today I'm going to be showing you how to fix Logitech G Hub not recognizing your G29 or G920 wheel or any Logitech gaming peripherals for that matter. As you can see here, I am on the Logitech um, G Hub right here, and it's only recognizing my G513 carbon. My G29 wheel is not appearing here, so I'm going to quickly show you how to get that fixed. First thing you want to do is you want to go to your search bar here. You want to type in program data percent. So percent program data percent. You want to open that. You want to go to LG Hub and you want to open up properties right here. You want to go to security. You want to change the permissions over here. And for users, you want to allow uh, modifying, and I, I just allowed everything right here, as you can see, right, read, and all of these. You want to click apply, OK, OK, and that should allow you to save the file. So let's open up current. You want to click Control F, and you want to type in G29, which is the wheel that I'm trying to uh, fix here. And as you can see, for required over here, you can see it's set to false, the value set to false. You just want to change that to true. You want to click Control S to save it or just save. And you close and that should be done. Next thing you want to do is you want to open up your task manager and you want to restart or end the task for LG Hub Updater. Once you've done that, you then want to open up Logitech Gaming, uh, Logitech G Hub over here, and it should be fixed. And there you have it. Now the G29 is now appearing in Logitech G Hub. And that'll be it for today's video guys. Uh, thanks for watching. This should work with all your other Logitech devices. I've only tried it with the G29 so far so don't quote me on that. But yeah the value normally after an update it, it goes it changes sometimes. I mean mine did change after the April 2020 update. So thanks for watching guys. Leave a like, subscribe. Goodbye.